Hi Libra, welcome to this Tower Love reading. My name's Sophia, welcome to this community. So what I was picking up was uh, intuition. So, uh, and I feel this is more your person. So I feel they're more connected with their intuition at this time. I feel that it's more of an inner knowing of you're the one. Where, mm, I'm not saying that they didn't before, but they kind of pushed it away or ignored it. But now I feel there's an absolute inner knowing you're the one. But I'm not getting any action steps. I feel there's an, a, still an internal conflict. I think the intuition knows, the heart knows, it's the mind that's trying to get their mind around it. Because they it's something like long term. They know with you they want long term. And they're trying to figure out, and there's something about other conflicts, like internal and external. There's an external conflict as well. What I'm getting is actually the good, the bad, and the ugly. So the good is they know you're the one. There's no doubt. It's like when they doubt it, intuition kicks in. Okay, that's my person. You know, the bad is, like I said, I don't feel action. <laughs> And the ugly, it's not really ugly, but I feel they're not taking action because there's ex external conflict. So let's um, let's see what the cards say, what is going on with your person and also you, because that was your person's energy, I feel. So it might be a separation here, uh, but four of wands is here, so... <laughs> That's not going to be long, this separation. Uh, okay, yeah. Yeah, this separation isn't long. So let's see. I've done, oh, I've done different camera angle today. So <laughs> I'll, I'll show you them then on here. Uh, okay. Okay. So, first card is, well, I'll, I might show you. <laughs> the full, three, oh yeah, okay, I'll show you. The full, three of swords and four of wands. Yeah, so what I'm getting from this is, your person is going into their feminine, because my, my full card is the a female because if you're light worker twin flame star seed whatever you are here to take the lead your reason the reason is because the feminines are more of the emotions and this planet is of love so jumping into the unknown is just following that bliss of love which most people then logicate oh i can't just go for my my uh wishes and desires because logically I have to pay bills, logically that person is with someone else, logically they're not good for me, they're different colour, belief, tradition, you know, but this is about taking the risk. So I feel that your person is going to take the risk and follow their emotions because the energetic frequency or feeling of your person was heart and intuition, right? So this is about jumping into that. Because they want to turn their back on this heartbreak. I said, I feel there's a, a separation. And they're, they're tired of it, you see. They want to, so, but they know that they have to jump into and take a risk. The full, there's something about a risk, and that was the ugly, which I called part of the relationship. There's something external, and it's like they have to leave that behind and jump into just a, a fresh new start because of the fool uh, only jumps in normally on traditional he has a little because uh, it's normally on a traditional one the traditional rider weight they ha he has a little bag right my one there's no bag but it doesn't matter meaning he only takes a little bit and leaves everything behind and that's that's risky jumping into the unknown the reason why i'm saying that is because in case some of you are thinking why aren't they coming? Why are they not, you know, why is he not contacting me? Why he or she is not moving towards me? 
This is why, because they see it's risky. But at the same time, give them time to jump into that unknown, A, and two, to leave something behind which they feel is risky. I'll give another example of what I'm seeing here. It's like they have to leave their family or they might risk upsetting a baby's mum, which means that they feel that they might not see their one or their children again. Something like that. This is a risk because it's unknown to them. They normally go over and maybe follow you know, baby's mum come round on a Tuesday and that's probably where they just leave you in the lurch because baby's mums and stuff like that. Maybe their parents is like saying, go out with Sarah Jane, she's a good match for you. And they don't really know you and you're generally different. You're not like what their family or their friends, their upbringing is like. Generally light workers, twin flames, humanitarians you know you we're different people we're not following the 3d way of life as such so to go, say to their family i'm not going to follow your you know baby's mum i'm not getting back with baby's mum i'm going with someone completely different who generally follows their, their own rules their own different you know humanitarian and it's fights for whatever and you know does you know Reiki, acupuncture, and all these kind of things, it's different. This is this, but it's their happiness, because the fool looks towards the sun in my deck and in the, the uh, Rider Wake, meaning the, the sun is the most happiest card in the deck. So that means that they are looking to take the risk. So this is the planning. Like I said, I don't feel there's action. So this is the first card. They're planning to do it. Because this is the first card. They're fed up with this heartbreak. They're fed up with the heartbreak as well of other people letting them down, of um, ex-relationships. That's another thing they need to heal. Because they're looking at the sun. This is being healed now. The four of wands is that leads to then commitment of you. This is what this means to me. That leads to, and like I said, you are generally different. You see, this is different colours, different age. I said to her to make it, you know, grey hair. So, you know, a bit older, that kind of thing. Could be distance, religions, traditions. This is like, but it's next to you. So it's like, I'm taking the risk because I'm fed up with breaking your heart, breaking my heart to be with you. That's what's going on, what I'm picking up with this. Underneath, like I said, the fall is going within. Like I said, I feel within is connecting with heart and um, intuition. They, but the mind is now logicating how to take it. But that's the hermit. So this is about being in isolation. So there's, there's a separation here, with, hence the three of swords. But I feel with this reading, it was needed for your person to work it out needed time alone to feel this heartbreak so they know you're the one they say that don't they if you separate then they recognize you're the one and you walk away then you realize what you've lost and all that that's kind of part of this reading as well with your person recognizing that so that's what he's doing also recognizing that he's been following a belief system that is creating this heartbreak this will eventually, right, lead, this is my moving in card, I don't know what else to say, <laughs> you know, these are my cards, I created them and this is my meaning to it, this will eventually lead to moving in with you, right, obviously this isn't everyone that's listening, but this is what my, this is what this card means to me, being wise and recognising um, why he's, um, not moving in with you, which is creating heartbreak, you see, not moving towards moving into with you as well, this is also to me, I'm um, getting is, um, wants to be more of a knight in shining armour to you, wants to more emotionally invest, the horse is in the, you know, in the, in the, I don't know what that is, because it's in the woods, you see what I mean? It's in the woods, but there's a, like a river. I don't know what that is, right? But it's in the water. So he's emotionally investing as well. 
because of and so there's so there's a separation here and your person's maybe not emotionally investing but that creates heartbreak my three of this three of swords is 3d heartbreak which are what i mean by that is other people following you're you're different but so is your person he doesn't or she doesn't really know that but the reason why they don't follow the traditions um why there's so much drama with your person is because they don't follow the traditions of the programming of others they generally do it and it causes drama because it's against oneself you guys are, uh, are a heightened um light worker star c to to go against against the, the social norms as such not to protest against it or to fight against it but generally to follow your own beliefs well, it's not really beliefs, your own free freeness of what you want to do. Your person generally follows a belief from their parents, such as you do, and, you know, settles with someone, and they don't really settle, and they have kids and stuff like that. Then they meet you, this is your person's contract, and they realise that, oh, well, what I was doing with this person, would they have babies, mums, or marriages or stuff before, you know, was fake. You're the one that i want to do it with but in short what happens is because they had so much drama with the exes they're like oh but if i do it with you will it be the same like with someone in the past they know you're different so they don't want to put the same on to you because you might feel well, why well they got married or they live with someone or they was with someone else but the situation here is that well yeah if you for example this is how they may see it. I'm not saying exactly this is a collective reading, but this is what I'm picking up. Say your person lived with someone and they had a baby. Then they met you, Twin Flame, Light Worker, Star C. They're like, poor, this is a massive connection, right? Hold on, I quite like this connection. I don't want them involved with this drama over here. A, that's why they keep you a secret, right? They keep you away from the drama because you're not normally involved in that web over there, family, friends, babies, mums, etc. Two, okay, well, I lived with someone. It was a fucking nightmare. But this one's all right. So you know what? I'm not going to live with this one, right? Okay, I emotionally invest and gave my all, all to this relationship. It was shit. I like this one, so I'm not going to do that. They kind of get it mis messed up because you think, why don't they? But they're actually, A, protecting their heart, which it doesn't work. Because look, three of swords in the middle between both of you, because this is your person, the fool. So, you know, being foolish, <laughs> was being foolish, now changing to, to positive because I feel he's jumping or she's jumping into the unknown. But they try to protect their heart, but then it creates heartbreak to them in, in the end anyway. So what's happening now is the planets is helping them to see more clearly at the end of the day like i said why i went into that long spill because they know you're different six of cups is a gift from upstairs they know well i'm not saying they know that you're from upstairs <laughs> you know but you know it depends you might be saying listen i'm a light worker i'm a twin flame i'm an activist they know you're different Without you even opening your mouth, generally they know from the start just like you do. I'm not saying they will say it, but they might know, right? Sometimes it takes a bit longer, um, or it does, I mean, with my situation, uh, David knew from the start. I didn't. I didn't know what it was, but my sister kind of put me in, in the know as soon as I told her, look, it's a bit weird how I feel. But generally, most of you know that you're, there's a different connection. This is knowing your different connection because, like I said, six of cups to the four of wands is your different. And when you have something different, they're kind of trying to treat it differently. They don't know how to treat something differently. As well, you must understand. They've had same old relationships, same old relationship. Oh, there's something different, right? So this is to kind of have an understanding of where they're at, where they're from, what they're doing at the moment. Underneath, like I said, this then leads to victory. This is the wands. This is them taking the action. Before this is five of wands, and I said to you the energy at the beginning was that 
internal external conflict that's five of wands other people's interference which is affecting internal and i feel like i said this could be babies mums this could be family this could be belief traditions this is oh well you're older you're younger he's older he's younger it, you know it's something like that that he he's trying to work out at the moment then and it's a battle because um five of wands is battles but then they overcome that battle like i said internal battle external battle good bad ugly this is the good victoriously so if you want to know more about your journey twin flame starseed light worker soulmate um go on to the website and buy the programs i've um slashed them really cheap now and also the people on the uh, subscription list are selling them the same price as well um i can't remember but it's it's it's, it's less than half price as well so or, or book a, a, a reading with me um i think it's it's what i'm doing now is a deal you get it way cheap the twin flame starseed light worker soulmate program if you do an image or tower reading so i hope you like this reading speak to you later